finally tonight, when you think of Christmas, sunny Florida is probably not the first place that comes to mind. But after this story, it might be. Here's CBS's Christian Benavides. Okay. Welcome. I love your bag. A visit to the post office this time of year may seem like a chore. Got my letters. But in Christmas, Florida, it's a tradition. Good morning. Don King is the postmaster for the town of about 2,000 residents that keeps a Christmas tree up 365 days a year. Much like the town, the post office keeps Christmas decorations up year round. But it's during the holidays when it sees the most visitors. It is absolutely the busiest time of year for us. The post office handles letters to and from Santa. And we've got a reindeer. And also has decorative stamps. This is going to the United Kingdom, Australia, Japan. It's where Skylar Hand comes to mail more than 100 holiday letters every year. It, it's ironic to send a Christmas card from Florida from Christmas. You know, you don't think of like Christmassy things in Florida. LaDonna Johnson is all about the Christmas spirit. This has been her go-to post office for two decades. To get a card from someone that they know and love cares about them, yeah. that means that's just a special thing. It's a lot of fun. It's Emily Acosta's first year. We're starting our tradition, yep. While for Walter Alcoin, the annual trip holds a special memory. This is our favorite part of the year every year, so a little hard for me, so keep the tradition going. He and his wife of 30 years would make the 50-mile drive to Christmas to mail their cards. She went all out for Christmas every year. Full, full tree, full lights at home. Cynthia Alcoin died 10 years ago. I know she knows I'm still doing this to this day. I know she's watching down on me doing it. A holiday tradition that embraces the spirit of the season and shares it with that special postmark. Cristian Benavides, CBS News, Christmas, Florida.